Alright, this might be a little bit confusing at first, but just stick with me here, I promise this will make sense eventually. A lot of you are thinking that you can't dream, or that you don't have dreams, and this is fundamentally you're wrong. And the reason for that is, unless you're one of the very few unlucky people with a sleep disorder that affects how much REM sleep you get, uh, things like insomnia, sleep apnea, these sorts of things, if you have that disorder then this is slightly different and it doesn't really apply to you but for most people for 99 percent of people watching this video thinking i can't dream i don't have dreams or i'm not having any dreams what's wrong with me this sort of thing you're just wrong uh, the reason for that is that every single person with the exception of people with sleep disorders has dreams every single night what really the problem is is that you just don't remember them and these are two different problems so you don't you should not think you know, I can't dream or I'm not having dreams because you are having them, you just haven't learned or haven't practiced actually remembering them. And there's a big difference. A lot of us when we first when we first have that sort of profound dreaming experience, you know, that first dream when you're really impressed with what's happened and you feel like something has changed, that is usually the moment where most of us even care about dreams to begin with. And before then you, you didn't really practice writing them down, did you? You didn't practice dream recall, you didn't do memory techniques or anything like that. You just sort of let your dreams do what they wanted to. And you, you might remember the occasional dream. That leads you down the, the path of failed thinking in which you, you start believing that you only are having the dreams that you remember having. That's just not the case. You are actually having very intense, interesting dreams every single night the chances are you're just not actually remembering them all. Uh, and that's actually a good thing. That's, like, that's easy to fix. You know, there are lots of ways you could remember your dreams and, and you can learn to remember your dreams. There are dozens of different techniques I could suggest for this. What The first thing I would suggest to do out before you do anything else is just consider having a look at my Remember Your Dreams ebook. Um, it's a very detailed guide on how to remember your dreams and it actually puts things in line for you and explains things a lot better than I would say anything else can do. Uh, this is from my personal experience and a lot of research has gone into this. But if you are if you don't think you can dream or you just want to remember more of your dreams, go and check out the link in the description and have a look at it, have a read and just see sort of roughly what you're going to learn. If it's something you're interested in, then go and check it out. If not, then leave it, of course. But yeah, I just really wanted to put this one to rest about the dreaming um, and not, not having dreams or not thinking you're having dreams. Everybody has dreams, you just need to learn how to remember them. Thanks for watching guys, this video and this channel are supported by my Patreon followers. Please consider giving just a dollar a month to support this channel, or just click the links in the description, you'll find links to various lucid dreaming products, articles, techniques and tutorials. If you did enjoy this video, please click the notification bell and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Why are you still watching this? You should have clicked one of my related videos by now, right? Or subscribed, or gone onto my website or something like that.